and, you know, enjoying it. Not going to see much of it, but, you know, it, it's nice to be out here. Let's talk about the team kind of as we approach training camps. You guys, one game away from making the Super Bowl last year. You've added a couple of key players, some big, big names to the roster. Is the team better this season? Oh, definitely. You know, I, I think we had a great spring, you know, after doing everything that we did in the off season. Um, guys came out working and uh, really had the focus that, you know, we were uh, a half a football away from being in the Super Bowl. And uh, I think that was an extra motivation for our guys to come together. And well, I think we did some good things, and training camp's going to be a blast. Talk to me a little bit about the young quarterback, uh, Mark Sanchez. I mean, certainly we all watched him grow. Describe to me how you saw him grow throughout the season. You know, I think it was really impressive what he did. Uh, about halfway through the season, he was having a little down spell. Things weren't going great for him. Uh, and at that point, you know, you look at rookies, you, you could go either way. They could, you know, put it in the tank or they can get better. And he got better, and uh, he really showed that in the playoffs. And, you know, this, uh, this offseason, having, you know, being physically limited, I think, has helped him a ton because he had really got in and, and studied and learned what he had to. He seems like he's a natural leader, but still will have to grow into that role. Meanwhile, you lose a definitive leader on the team in Alan Fanica. How much do you think that loss will affect this team? You know, it is difficult to get through, um, you know, but it is part of the business and, and you move on. And uh, while he was here, you know, he helped lay the foundation that, that we uh, as an offensive line, like to believe that we are a uh, great offensive line, and to be great, you know, we got to be able to plug a guy in and, and still do um, the things that we want to do. You're gonna have to plug in a young guy. A young, well, we'd like to believe anybody, you know. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's gonna be a young guy, you know, and, and it's gonna be a great battle to watch during training camp. I'm excited, you know, to be next to it to see everything, see how it unfolds. Um, but it is, you know, there's gonna be some growing pains, but I think we'll get through them. You guys were so good last year as a line and as an offense at running the ball. Do you expect to pass the ball a, a significant amount more this season? You know, I don't know. Um, I haven't really talked to Shadi too much about uh, the philosophy going into this year, but I know uh, our bread and butter is pounding the rock, and, and that's what we do, and uh, we pride ourselves on it, and I expect to do more of it. The headline of the day, of course, is the uh, contract extension for Elvis Dumerville. One of your teammates, DeBrickashaw Ferguson, has worked out his deal. I know you've been vocal about the fact that you would like an extension uh, to work on your deal. Fill me in on, on kind of where that stands right now. Um, you know, it's just it, disappointing right now where we're at, um, you know, but it's one of those things you go through. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm professional. I've done everything the right way, and I'm going to continue to do that, you know, be there for my teammates and, and the coaches. And, uh, you know, we'll see how it all plays out. What's disappointing? Just the fact that, you know, I've, I've done the best that I could, you know, since uh, the Jets gave me the opportunity and drafted me. And um, now here I am going in the final year of my contract where, you know, anything could happen. And uh, I, could, I could go for a couple more years on a contract. And, um, you know, it's disappointing not having those years. So I know you obviously are thinking about the team and, and you have to think about yourself and your future. What does that mean when it comes to training camp and the potential?